Hey guys, so welcome to episode 14. Um, we are going to get into the agricultural side of this. I'm going to start with making the uh, watering can. I'm going to make some sprinklers, and then I'm going to rip into this side as much as I can and go along this. The only thing I don't know is the uh, feed the chickens. Like, um, if you... If you look it up, uh, chicken, here, it doesn't tell me anything. Stage mob grinding utils, nothing in the, in the table when you get chicken feed. So I think that's probably where we're going to get stuck. And if that's the case, it's no big deal. We will work on those machines over there that I'm doing. Because, like I said before, I think they're pretty much useless, but... I started it, might as well finish it. So, for round one, we are doing a watering can. So I need a bucket of water, some bone meal, and four iron ingots. Let's take this whole stack. We're gonna need more. We'll take half of these, we turn them into bone meal. Actually, let's take the whole stack. We'll, we'll need more. So, let's uh, grab the buckets, and let's go from there. So, let's start with this. Get the bone meal. We got buckets of water. Oh, buckets. They will soon be full of water. We got this crazy blacksmith villager chilling out in my water bucket. Yeah, what you gonna do now, huh? Done taking your bath. So, alright, so we got some water buckets. I'm gonna need three of them total, but yeah, I might as well get three while we're at it. I'm gonna try to be as efficient as humanly possible to get all this done. That's that's the game plan. So first off, we're gonna do we're going to make the watering can. It's I think it's this. With a bone meal? No, that's not right. How how do I make a watering can? That's close. Boom. Watering can. Alright. So now we got a watering can, and that's great. But we're not going to rock a watering can. We're too good for that. We're going to go and make a, a sprinkler system. So we can take, we'll take these here bars. We will make... I need six bone blocks. And then we go, I think, this way, that way, a bucket of water. Alright, so we get a sprinkler. But we're not going to stop at one. We're going to go ahead and make two. Because now we're going to take these sprinklers... We're going to place them at our uh, Infernium Seed Plot. Uh, Infernium Seed Plot for starters. I'm going to make some more uh, later on in this this particular episode. I'm going to try to make Ender Seeds. So I'm going to make a special patch for that. But we'll, we'll see. I don't want to get too, uh, too ahead of myself. Alright, now that should water the plants so many times per tick or something. It shouldn't take anything. There it goes. Alright. So it'll water all these for me. And we're going to do the same thing over here. To speed up the Infernium. Now I know I'm not at that part of the game yet. And I know I'm not too familiar with the... Uh, the mod packs, but I figured it is a, it's a good stepping stone. So now we have the watering can done, and we have the sprinkler done. So, I'm going to do this one. Uh, place snad to grow sugarcane seeds atop. To grow sugarcane seeds atop it at an accelerated rate. So in order to make snad, you need sand... Which I could have swore I had in my inventory, but it appears that I do not. <coughs> so, I have to go grab some sand.
you know, make some snad. Now, instead of worrying about sugar cane, we'll just take, uh, let's we'll take three of these. It's not like I don't have a ton of it. Thought I just ruined my crops. It's gonna be like, no! So, from here, we're gonna do three. Not particularly, not particularly because we have to, but I figure it's a, uh, It's an achievement, and it wouldn't really hurt. Alright, so now we have the sugarcane done. So now we want to work on... I'm going to save this to last, because, like I said, I have no idea how to do that. So let's do the... Stay hydrated. We're going to make a hydro gel. It takes <clears throat> four iron bars, four green slime balls, and a bucket of water. So let's go and uh, get some more buckets of water. some slime balls can make a total of five okay we'll make five of them because that will that will do one infernium field infernium field all right so let's do that we need 20 bars so let's do, uh, let's do it like this, water bucket, and there we have it, one, two, three, Four and five. So th I think that's enough to do my uh, do at least one field of um, what should I call it? Infernium. Yes, one field of infernium. And I'll make it my good field, the field I'm gonna make uh, tier two in soon. Wow, that went that went really quick. Oh, well, that's a problem. Okay, so we're going to use it where I'm going to put my ender, ender pearl seeds. We'll just do one more. It'll be fine. So let's, uh... Let's see if we can repair this water. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, so apparently I can't make it flow after I put those in there. No, it, it's it's fine. So we're going to grab a dirt. We're going to place this with dirt. And we are going to make ender pearl seeds next. So right now we are just zooming right through here. We're going to make ender pearl seeds. The diagonal fence. I might check out the bean, bo bean, bean boozled thing. And that'll pretty much put us at this thing. I know this. I know this. I do not know this. So, and like I said, we're going to save the mulch till who knows when. We're going to save the mulch for a while. Because I don't really know. I I'm not particularly in need. Um, I made purple slimy dirt to grow my slime trees in 
which is more efficient than this mo uh, brown mulch, and it's still like it, it's just. I mean, I I can't keep up with it. So what's the point? You know, there's no point in being that efficient if you know if it's just gonna waste time. I guess I can't turn that back into regular sand either. Let's go and take uh, let's just take three of these to be safe. All right. So we're taking a seed. Now I'm only making one of these for obvious reasons. I only have one ender or seven ender pearls, so I can only make one. But that's all right because I think they'll give me more seeds, and if not, they'll give me more ender pearls, which I can in turn make more seeds eventually. So let's do that. I should put that fancy little bone miller on uh on whatever wherever I put this, but that's another that's another story. Uh, can't grow. Light 15 is greater than 7. So it's got to be dark? Oh, it, it, it's nighttime. Oh, I guess the, uh, the torches, maybe? Yeah, it's still a 15. Um, well, that's interesting. I don't know what to do about that. Hmm. Okay, well, we got the... I'll, I'll figure out something for that later. We got the Ender Seed, so let's check out the being boozled because I could care less about diagonal fences. And like I said, I'm at a I'm at a standstill at this point. So let's check out being boozled and see what we could do there. Bean boozled. Magic green. Grow and grow to harvest random random junk and treasures. I need a cactus. And four seeds. All right, no big deal. Let's. Um, that's not too bad. Um, the the thing that's gonna hold me up the most is I gotta dry a bunch of jungle saplings to be able to get vines to be able to get a cactus. That's the only real hold up there. Let's uh take a couple of these. I thought it wasn't going to work. I was like, no, why? Alright, then those will do their thing. Uh, until then, let's see what else we got. Let's make the... The cotton swab, which is... Swab. Two cotton and a stick. So that should be... Or two wool and a stick. That should be relatively easy. Uh, this chest has the blocks, so I will find two wool. And this chest has the sticks, so I need one stick. Now, it says I can swab a chicken. Let me fill up on donuts here. I'm a, I'm a fatty. I, I switched from acorns to donuts. Now I think we need eight vines, so I have to do this one more time. But until then, let's go and swab us a chicken. Come here, chicken. I'm gonna swab you. Okay, so now I have the achievement swab the deck. So bam. Now, I do not know what to do with that. Uh, what's it called? Mob Swab?
Yeah, it's the same thing. I don't know. That that has us at a standstill there. So that I'm stuck on, and we will have to. Come on, hurry up. Okay, so I think it's eight. I'm gonna check and see if it's six or not. But I, I think it's eight. Come on, Judge Judy. It is eight, and I have six. So I gotta wait for these guys to get done. And we will make the next particular item. I uh, got 50% to go. Let's go harvest our Infernium real quick. Stupid open hand policy. So it's going to put that fancy congealed stuff over here. I thought it would be more useful, but I don't know if it'll work with the sprinklers. I kind of feel like it won't. I guess I could try it, but I'm not... I kind of feel like the sprinklers are going to be... What is going on? Why am I... What was that all about? I just fell into an abyss. I went to a black hole of death and doom and disparity. Anyways, yeah, I don't think the sprinklers will shoot out congealed metal grated slime to water my plants. And I kind of feel like this would probably be... Probably be the most efficient way. Remind me not to get too close to the sprinklers because I really would rather not get like sucked into a vortex of doom. I mean, my armor's pretty good. If I had got stuck in there, I'd probably have been there for a little while until I actually died. And all right, so we're stocking up on infernium. I'm sure this has like at least ten, six. Waste of waste of machinery. Stupid waste of machinery. I can't believe I wasted my time with this mod pack. There is a hundred and... A hundred and thirteen pages of recipes, and I picked the one mod pack that's a complete waste of time. That is very upsetting. But, you know, it is what it is. You know, not getting too angry, watching the blood pressure. <laughs> it's fine. So I got a cactus. Anyways, cactus time. What are we doing with the cactus? What are we doing with the cactus? Uh, the bean boozled. I'm doing the bean boozled. Seeds around a cactus. Easy enough. It'll give me four seeds. I'm going to spread those over by the ender plant there. And we'll see how that goes. Uh, seeds. Let's get... We'll just take half of those. And we'll go over here. I wonder why a cactus. I mean, it could be anything. And it's a cact... Ooh, I could do cactus seeds. No, it doesn't matter. Alright, bean boozled. I am bean boozled. I'm being boozled on why I chose that mod pack. Do I have more dirt? I do have more dirt. Alright, so we're going to... Until I figure out what exactly to do with, uh... The ender pearl stuff, we're gonna just plant these right here. I really wasn't expecting red seeds, or red growthlings. I was expecting, I don't know. I don't know what I was expecting, but I wasn't expecting that. Alright, let's see where we're at now. Um, diagonal fences. That sounds like a giant waste of time. Let's, uh, let's see if this works. You must be in a world with prestige and able to use this menu. Alright, so I cannot use the prestige, which is disappointing, because what's the point of having...
prestige points if I can't prestige anything. That is interesting. All right, we might as well keep going. Uh, let's uh, let's do the diagonal fence. I still don't find a actual use for this. Like, I don't understand, like, what's the point. But I guess we're going to make them anyway. I need three fences and four sticks. I might not have any fences left. <clears throat> so I may have to make fences, which is unknown to me, regardless how many times I make them. Alright, four planks, two sticks, so I need a whole stack of sticks. Just take 45, should be good. And we'll take these 25 planks, and we'll go from there. Alright, so... I'm only making one, because I can't find a use for this. I mean, I'm sure there is. But, I mean... I don't need it, so it's whatever. And now we have our first set of diagonal fences. Game over. We win. We got everything we need. Diagonal fences. Alright, so... I'm not going to get every mob seed anytime soon. I will work on it, but as it stands, it's going to take a while. Um, I do not know how to cram a cow into a jar. Uh, my common sense is, is not there for me on that one, I mean... I don't care, it better be a pretty big jar. And I have no idea how to make chicken feed. Because if it was my opinion, I would just make a sack and fill it full of seeds and be done with it. But apparently I need mob DNA, so I'm stuck there. So we accomplished all six of these. And that's pretty good. That's, that's pretty good. I wonder if I can make any of this stuff. Let's see. Craft a nuclear craft energy upgrade to decrease energy usage of machines. See, nuclear craft sounds a little bit, I don't know, out of our league? It, it seems a little uh, non-existent, literally. What makes these nuclear craft, I wonder? Alright, so... Let's see if there's something else that gives a tip here. Energy upgrade to decrease energy usage of machines. Energy upgrade. We'll try that. Energy upgrade. Hold shift for details. Increased energy efficiency and capacity of machinery. Alright, so let's see how we make it. Uh, stained glass, piece of cake, pulverized gold. I can do it. I can do pulverized gold. Mechanical squeezer. Alright, so... Let's see what these are. Uh, metallurgic infuser. Alright, so we need a metallurgic infuser. Let's see about making that. <laughs> two furnaces, an osmium ingot, four iron, and two redstone. So let's, let's make a metallurgic infuser. And probably a better generator. Do I have osmium in here? I know I have osmium. Look at that. One ingot of osmium. Just what I needed. Alright, osmium ingot. Do I have any more osmium ingots? Block of Inva. Uh, it appears that that is the only osmium ingot I have. But... I think I have osmium ingot trees. Yeah. Yeah, I have osmium ingot trees, so I can make a ton of osmium whenever I feel like it. So, I can spare an ingot. It's fine. 
Um, I need cobblestone. We'll just grab a stack. <laughs> now I just made, uh, a whole stack of furnaces. Or all that is into furnaces because eventually I'm probably going to need it. So I'm not too broken up about it. <clears throat> I do need redstone though. <laughs> all right, now I'm going to be pretty certain that this is going to require power. Uh, stored energy, yeah, I need RFs, so I need to figure out how to supply this with power. And that's going to be complicated, because I plan to make a nuclear generator, like, smack dab in the middle of all this. And then I'll run one to that machine, run one to that machine, and then run cables over here to all the other stuff. So, let's place it right there for now. Let's see, what does it take to make... A nice, giant, nuclear generator. I hope it has the same mod pack as my other one. <clears throat> and it doesn't appear like it does, so... <laughs> Might have to figure out something else. Let's see, uh... What's the best generator I can make? That generator's crap. I don't have biofuel yet. Crap, crap. Uh, energy battery, one million RF. In a furnace, one million, that's a lot. Crystallized mineral, block of crystallized mineral, block of redstone, I can probably manage that. So I need a ton of min uh, mineral stuff. So let's get a... Uh, Let's grab a block of redstone and a stack of mineral stuff. Here we go. One stack of mineral stuff. All right. So, I'm not sure if that's the best one to make, but I'm doing it anyway. I don't care. Now let's check it out one more time. Generator. Shift for it, though. Produce energy from fuel items. All right. So, it's not too specific on what it actually uses, but... I'm sure it'll be alright. So I need two blocks of this. And two. And then take all that out of there. And we need one, two, three, four. Redstone. Two of these fancy little things. And I th was it two furnaces? It wasn't two furnaces. I'm, I'm missing something. Okay, so this goes here, this can go back here, back here, here, and this takes six of these. I was, I was, hey, I was close, all right? So throw that on there, that in there, and we have this, hopefully, super generator. A million RFs is pretty freaking good. Okay, so it takes wood. All right, so now this should be... Getting power? Oh yeah, here we go. Powering. Alright, so we have power. Now let's see how to use the metallurgic infuser to make... What were we trying to make? I don't remember what we were trying to make. Uh, these things. Um, <clears throat> energy somethings. Energy upgrade? I don't think that was it. This looks familiar. Energy upgrade. Alright. That's not it. Uh, let's see. Let's, let's read this again. Craft a nuclear energy upgrade. Alright, so we're going to type in energy upgrade. And this is the one we were looking at. The, the easy one. Stained glass. Pulverized gold. 
Uh-oh, lag time. Come on. Don't do this. I'm just so close to the end of the episode. I want to crank out one more thing. Come on. Alright, guys. So it appears that we are going to get into the next section on my next episode. Because as much as I'd love to wait for this machine to decide that I can play again, I am... We're at 30 minutes, and that's about the time I like to call it quits. You know, I try to range between 30 and 45 minutes, because if I'm on YouTube and I'm looking around, the last thing I want to do is watch a video for, you know, an hour and a half. Usually a half an hour is like, okay, 45 minutes is like the cutoff. So I'm going to call it quits there, and uh, and we're back. We are back, baby. So ignore everything I just said, and we are going to... It takes a whole, don't tell me it takes a whole block of redstone. And this is like redstone heavy. Let's see. Um, it takes a lot of redstone. Okay, so we need a ton of redstone. Looks like I'm going to be farming redstone, I'll tell you that. Ah, wrong one. Let's pop these in here. Oh, I already got two. That's that's good. All right. So I guess it... Haha, <laughs> there you go. Okay, that works. So let's just make a... I'm going to need a couple of these. Let's just cram out a whole bunch. Um, that's, that's perfect. I thought it was going to take a crap ton of redstone, but that's... I mean, it's still taking a good bit, but I can, I can live with that. So, all right. So we got... Well, we need to make that. Let's... Wait, can I make... Crushed Quartz, Crushed Obsidian, Gold Weighted Pressure Plate. Do I have to make this, or can I make this one? Eh, you know what? We're gonna make one of each. Uh, I need... I need to put some of this crap away, is what I need. Let's take two gold, and we'll... Crush it up. Let's grab what glass we have. We'll grab half of it. Die, gold, die. Um, okay, I think that's about as far down as it gets. What happened to my gold? Alright, so, um, let's check this again. Okay. Squeezer. Oh, it's gotta be gold ore? That is... disappointing. Gold amber. Do I have gold amber? Let's check and see if we have some gold amber laying around. If not, we can whip some up. Actually, I'm going to call it quits here anyway. Uh, it seems to be a good time before I get too into something that I'm unfamiliar with. Uh, gold amber. And we do not have gold amber. So, we're going to call it quits here. And, uh, I'll collect myself, get my thoughts together, and, uh, get ready for the next one. Alright, thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one.